Yeah, can't wait. Can't wait. And we always, you know, George Michael's music. Like, yeah, look, Last Christmas is one of the best songs ever made, Christmas songs ever made, and so why not make a mu movie out of it? It's great. And being part of that era of such amazing pop music and the legacy it's left behind. Absolutely, you know, the 80s was all about pop bands and pop music and great songs. And George was a great writer of great songs, and that's so great. And he loved Christmas, so he would have loved this. And, you know, what are you up to next? Can you tell us about your next project? Can you tell us what you're doing next? Uh, at the moment, yeah, I've got an album out at Christmas with Shirley. So the two of us are um, doing a swing album. Amazing! So comes, out, comes out two weeks time, 22nd of November. In the house, we do, you know, every day. I mean, uh, not using water bottles anymore. Not, plastic, using, not using plastic anymore and water bottles. That's so much waste. I mean, I spent, you know, last year I did um, uh, the island, Bay Grills, and if you ever saw what I saw, with the amount of plastic that is on beautiful island beaches, deserted island beaches, you'd be the same. It, um, it was stacked like house high on plastic everywhere you went on those islands, and they're beautiful. They're just ruined. You love it. Me and Shirley always love it. Yeah, sit down. But uh, listen, this song is one of the best Christmas songs ever made, so why not make a movie out of it? It's great. Uh, how do I best remember it? It's funny enough, um, Christmas was such a huge time for him. He was such a Christmas fan. And um, he, every Christmas for the last 30 years, he delivered to my house two massive hampers on Christmas Eve. And uh, I miss those hampers, like, <laughs> It's uh, the jam. Yes. The great, and listen, uh, that's what he did, you know, every Christmas. And that was for me and Shirley. It was always the start of Christmas. But uh, obviously now that's gone. We miss him like crazy. Same as everybody's, you know. Um, you know, Christmas dinner at two and watch the Queen's speech and then, and then uh, the karaoke in the evening.